Hi everyone. In this problem, we are given an isosceles triangle CAB in which side CA is equal to CB and angle ACB is equal to 20 degree. Angle ADB 60 degree and angle BAE is equal to 50 degree and we have to find the measurement of angle EDB. There are many more methods how to solve this problem but I have done whatever I have found easier. To get that we have to construct some extra things. So here we have constructed taking B as the center and BD as the radius of arc constructed this arc which intersects this B extended line at F and uh, BC at the point G. So by construction we can say that BF is equal to BD is equal to BG because the same radius. So we can say that and that is equal to BG. This angle is 60 degree given and this is equal to this BF this BF so this means BFD is an isosceles triangle but this angle is 60 therefore this will be an equilateral triangle so this is 60 degree and this also will be 60 degree now since this is 20 degree and CA is equal to CB we are given so angle CBA is equal to angle CAB and each will be 80, 80 degree. But this is 60 degree, the whole is 80 degree. So this will be only 20 degree. This is whole 80, this is 50, so this will be 30 degree. If we join DG, BG is equal to BD with this vertex angle as 20 degree. So this will be 80 degree. And if it is 80, it's linear pair, this will be 100 degree. So in triangle DFA and DGC, one more thing here, uh, BD is equal to DC. Since this is 20 and this is 20, so triangle CDB is an isosceles triangle and therefore BD is equal to DC. So here is DC. This is 80 and this is 60. So this will only be 40 and this is only 20. So this is exterior angle and will be equal to 60 plus 40 which is 100. So in triangle DFA and DGC this FD is equal to CD. This FD is because DFB is an equilateral triangle. DF, FB, BD, DC and BG all are equal. So DF is equal to DC. DF is equal to DC. Angle FAD is equal to angle DGC each angle is 100 degree and angle FD A is equal to angle DC G which is equal to 20 degree so by angle angle side test by angle angle side test angle angle side test these two triangles are congruent is congruent to triangle DAF by AAS test therefore this DG is equal to FA corresponding sides of congruent triangles are congruent so this GD is equal to this AF now in triangle EAB, this is 80 degree and this is 50 degree. So 80 plus 50 is 130 and 
this angle will be 180 minus 130 which is 50 so this is 50 and degree this is 50 degree so this triangle ABE is an isosceles triangle with AB is equal to BE so AB is equal to BE AB is equal to BE BG is equal to BF equal to BF and BG is equal to BE plus EG BF is equal to BA plus AF which implies that FA is equal to GE this FA and DG we found already equal now this FA and GE we are getting equal so these two will be equal now since these two are equal and this angle is 80 degree so this is 50 degree and this is 50 degree because some of the three angles of a triangle will be 180 now BG is equal to BD and this is 20 so this angle is 80 and this whole angle will also be 80 this is 80 the whole angle is 80 this angle is 50 so only this angle is 80 minus 50 which is 30 degree and that is the answer so therefore angle EDB is equal to 30 degree that is the answer.